You know, we fresh to death today. You already know, I'm back. Sean is back. But it's a little different today, because, you know, we got, everything's new. Got the new glasses, you know. Got the new hair. You know, we got to stay fly everywhere we go. And we got some more girls to get. You know, you know I ain't trying to be bummy out here, but um, Super Seducer 2 is here. We got more girls, probably better ones, to get, and you know we can do it. Ooh, they got some new music up in here. Can we rap to this though? Let's see what they got for us. Hold on. Oh, I got somebody singing for me. Mm. Hey, sing it. I got you. Check it. Super seducer. I'm about to seduce ya. Get into my bed and give me some head. Hey, we out here trying to get these girls that y'all on me. Hey. Just the second one. I'm about to get them young. Ha, I'm lying, but I'm trying to get these girls all off me. It's too many. We got the swag. A, I'm gonna bust that ass. All right. <laughs> See, you know, we had to try it out. We had to try it out the first time. I don't know if I'm gonna have one every time for this, for this beat, cause this beat a little bit different, but I had to try something out. Oh, what Hello the? Hello and welcome to Super Seducer 2. I think this is in We're the beginning back, of the last bigger one. bigger and better. But bigger and better, huh? I see all these new people. I listened to your feedback and we've made a number of improvements. All right, the first all thing right. is ethnic diversity. We've got Asian characters, black That's what's characters, up. Arab characters, and even a Scottish guy. Ooh, I also Scottish? To female players' feedback, and now you can actually play levels from a chick's perspective. <coughs> Finally, I'm joined what? by Charlotte. Hi, everyone, Ooh. and I'm here to try and give a little bit of a female perspective on things. Hope you all enjoy it. Look the like game. you're the best one to do Press that. Start, and I hope you enjoy it. I think I will enjoy this. I think I will enjoy this because you see that? They doing bigger and better stuff. You always, you always know when they make another game of something, it's usually bigger and better. But this, I think it's going to be a little special. All right. What we got here? Okay. We got how many chapters to go through so, this one? We got, I'm not even going to actually, you know, count how many. But, of course, you know, we got, uh, we got a few. He did say that we could um we we could be a girl in some of these levels, so I think I can see that. All right, that's what's up. I didn't want to lie to you, but we gotta start from the beginning, chapter one. Whoo! And let me tell y'all, I ain't lose no freaking swag because we got it like that. Just because it's been a while, it hasn't been that long. But either way. We don't never lose our touch. I'm about to show y'all right now. She just stepped off a yacht, but the supermodel is just too sexy. The choice is yours. Huh? We actually get a choice this time? <laughs> you, you shouldn't have told me that. Oh, oh, you shouldn't have told me that. But now this is this is about to be interesting. Okay, I see we out in the nature. You know, there's nothing bad about nature. But where is this about to go though? Like I'm actually what is <laughs> Nah I know this dude does not have a freaking tank that This is random as hell. A tank my boy And then you doing donuts and <laughs> Arthur I'm hungry man let's go to the restaurant <laughs> you got the nerve to come out looking like that in a tank. This, this. 
I just gotta clap it up anyway, just because. Just for making this more interesting than the last. The other one, like, I'm not gonna say that other one was boring, of course not, but this... Who thinks it is? Also, we fucked up the grass again, dude. Again? Oh, well, when did you do this the first time? And you know, as soon as he step on the... <laughs> So as he stepped foot on this place, everybody's looking at him. Even the guys. Like, come on. I ain't think they swing like that. But listen, that's not my business. Hey. Look, the waiter can't even hold his shit right. Hey. Girly, come give me a swirly. Hey. Oh, but he looking over there. I'm kind of looking over there too. <laughs> she got on a yacht. This is the one off the yacht. You see how you looking, girl? Hey. I don't know how she got off the yacht that fast, but even the old lady looking at her, like, they know she got it popping. He's looking at her, but she she's sitting in her own seat, though. <sighs> I should have known it would do this. <sighs> Why would I think she would come up to me, knowing that that's not how shit works nowadays? All right. How to approach her. Catch her attention non-verbally. Gaze into her eyes while beckoning her with your finger as if it's a <laughs> See, one thing I forgot to mention in the beginning of this is the last Super Seducer, we didn't do as much, you know, bad choices. That's not how it's going to be this time. This time we're going to do some we're going to do some bad choices more often than not because I need <laughs> I need to spice it up a little bit, but I don't think I should start with that. I don't know. I'm not in that type of mood to where I could start like that, but I, I, I'm, I'm going to do a few of them. I'm not even going to lie to you. But let's see. I'm, don't approach her at all. Eat a kumquat. I mean, we could try that. But I don't think I want to. Use the genius conversation starter from that YouTube guy. What YouTube guy? I don't even know who you're talking about. Go and tell her that she caught your eye. That you could join her. Can you join her for a few minutes? That's not a bad idea either, though. Like, what's wrong with saying you caught my eye? Shoot. Girls love hearing that shit. But I think I think we should, you know, do things non verbally first. Non verbally since we've all the way to fuck back there. When does she take her hat and stuff off? I, I don't remember she ever <laughs> I don't remember her doing that. Look, see a little little high. She doesn't look like she's that interested, but you know what, that doesn't matter. We we can hey. just Listen, I was just sitting there. Look, okay, she's Sorry. she don't. I don't think she likes you that I'm here. Eye, so hi. I thought I'd come and say hi. How are you doing? Hi, I'm I'm fine. That's good to hear. Coming for a spot of lunch. Oh, Everybody got that yeah. accent to them. Like this that, is a nice way to start because I think that's a good if choice you catch when it's blue. Before you actually walk up, okay. Uh, she has a chance to kind of get used to the fact that you're going to be talking to her. And if you kind of just walk up and she hasn't noticed you, it's a right. bit of a surprise when you suddenly start talking. I like that. It's a better way when you can do it. Yeah, I think it's also a little bit romantic. Okay, see, I, I like how they're so doing this now. Hi, I'm Lottie. Ah, uh, Lottie, like Charlotte, yeah? Yes, it is. Ah, yeah. lovely to meet you. Charlotte. Good to meet you too. How Hello, you doing, I girl? Say, hey, babe, the usual, please. <laughs> I mean, in his language, you know, that babe thing is not like, it's not taken the wrong way. But we're not going to do that because I'm not him. Order tea, cake, shot for confidence, something for her. Shot for confidence. You know, that could work. But again, we just met this girl. I don't want to be that confident yet. Tell her not to bother you. You're in an important conversation. I'll have a piece of cake. That lady will be eating my dick. <laughs> yo, y'all can't be serious with these choices, yo. You know what? Everything on this menu sucks. Let's go back to my place. Or order a tea cake and then something for her. <laughs> yo, the lady will be... 
<laughs> I, I, I'm trying not to just yet. I need to see how this kind of plays out. Like, this is only the second choice, and I'm thinking about pushing that. Because that's just... How is she, how she going to take that? That's what I... No, no, we can't, no. I'm, I'm going to just be normal so for right now. You would like? I'm going to be naughty today. I'm oh, going uh -huh. to go for the chocolate cheese. Maybe I should have picked nice. the, and the lovely dick. She want to be cheese. naughty. Okay, and I'm going to have the cherry cake, please, and English breakfast tea, but no milk. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Go away. I'm in my important conversation with this nice-ass lady. What is the latest or earliest time that I can have champagne? Oh. Is that a I question? Know, a question. But oh. if a guy came to sit with you, you wouldn't ask him to buy you champagne? No, but if he offered me a glass of champagne at 5.30 in the evening, that's Why quite not? romantic. 5.30 in the or evening? Or just a straight espresso. I mean, none of that sounds bad, though. Sorry? Brother, call me urgently. Yeah, um, look at her face. She's not with that. Ignore him, switch the phone to silent, call Mumad. No, F Muhad, Muhad. Listen, if there's a choice between you getting some and your, your homeboy's trying to call you, bruh, you can call him at any time. I mean, he did say urgently, like it was a, bruh, you'll be all right. I'm sorry, you'll sorry be all right. about that, just someone messaging me, let me put that Yeah, he's probably doing some, some bullshit anyway. I never do that, I never have my phone on when I'm talking to someone. No, it's oh, understandable. See, look, look, see? See y'all smiling, see? We getting that. We getting you know this. It's such a lovely day, and you're dressed amazingly. It's all summery, but it's got something to it, like a real interesting style you have. Thank Very you. Very nice. It's really nice of you to say. Well, so she all twirling her so hair and stuff, she's with it. What do you do? I'd like to know more about Richard. Alright, I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you everything you need to know, girl. I work wonders in bed. <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't hold it in no you. more. I work wonders in bed. <laughs> you get it? Do you know who you're talking to? Do, <gasps> Do you know who you talking to? You what? asked me, girl. I'm Lottie Wentworth Miller. Oh, okay, you she don't pulled out the like full that. name. Me. To me. It's not about you, it's about me. Baby. You I'm asked me. I've got skills in the bedroom. I think, oh my goodness, don't even talk about bed talk. Did she not ask you me what do I do? We're sitting at a table. Yeah, we'd be lying in a bed. Soon we're gonna be Yo, we're absolutely there. never Yo, gonna lie he, in bed. You'll be lying yeah, in that bed alone, and it'll be cold. Like yes. your attitude Why? is. Yes. Do you like grapes? Uh, she, she gonna throw that. She, I knew it. Just leave them in. Food fighting. Just like get out. Yeah, you, you're the child. You're making it. You're bringing it out to me, aren't you? <laughs> Disgusting. Just Yo. Go. Trot, trot, trot along. Spit spot, pervert. I mean, she did kind of ask me, so she should have expected something like that. Yo, I mean, I, I'm not even mad at that. I'm not even mad at that. Legendary line, Charlotte? No, terrible line. How is it? Um, Why is he what if you say caressing his hard? hair? Because my dick's hard. Any, yeah. Anything <laughs> along those lines? No, I'm going to say a blank never there. I, I'm sorry, y'all. I had to. Listen, you have to be... <laughs> that made it more interesting, though. That was fu That was funny. That's the first one I saw. I don't know why that caught my eye. Like, like she caught my eye. But, ooh, no, I gotta calm down. That was funny as shit. All right, we're gonna do. We're, we're gonna keep going. Make a joke and then tell the truth. I'm a mumble rapper. I mean, make it a joke. It's the way he. It, it's. It depends on the way he does it. Cause if he does it right, this shouldn't be a problem. Distract her. Do the ring finger DHV routine instead. I don't know what that is. I work for a pharmaceutical company. I said pharmaceutical. I I, I, I said it wrong. And make YouTube videos. That's the truth. I'm I, I'm looking at that. If it says truth, it's most likely right. So f them other ones. Well, I've got two things. The the first is uh, pharmaceuticals business. Wow, you must be very intelligent. Oh. What, what, what oh, in the pharmaceuticals? That. Do you do exactly? Well, we just have different drugs for different ailments and yeah, she, she, she illnesses and that conditions. Shit. So okay. that's the business, you know, like normal pharmaceuticals business. Yeah. Second she liking that shit. Look at her face. Is, uh, YouTube. So I make YouTube videos. Oh, that is exciting. People love YouTube. That sounds Look, amazing. Take notes. What do you do for that? And that's like the creative side, and the other sides, you know, yeah. the business side. But I've got all different videos and. 
Um, have to make like a new one every Tuesday. And Only oh, Tuesday? Wow. Well, he got the other shit he said. And yeah. Get advertising and stuff, so. That's fantastic. I still haven't got paid Good for on that, you. But, Thank but, you. you know, Brilliant. we're not gonna talk about that. She likes that. That's good, correct option. Yeah, I mean, telling the truth is always fine, right? Yeah, I think there's nothing wrong with being honest about what you do. She's gonna find out sooner or later. Exactly, which is why I don't lie. And what do you do for work? Oh, well, um, I don't really need to work. But oh, really? I do a you just got it like that, huh? Oh, lovely. You yeah. know, something interesting I've noticed, I've met some actors and they're always very interesting people because they're empathetic. Right. And that's absolutely I think that's because when they're acting they have to portray all these emotions. So uh -huh. they just understand people and emotions, they can read body I want language. To be an actor yeah, and that's what I love. I just love studying people and their nature. Mm. Um, I'm studying it's a you really right good now. Way to connect with people on a really deep level that not necessarily you can do in reality. Yeah, and <laughs> actors they think they're kind of like, extroverts like, I like that wouldn't this. connect like, with people. She's, but because they're of this, having a you can genuine really conversation. You can feel it. That's yeah. the kind of girl y'all need. The Amazing. ones that you could have a general conversation Absolutely. with. It's just a very cool job. Actually. Look, this is genuine yeah, it right is. here. It's, it's nice to dip in and out. Like, it's not all about looks. I mean, hey, do you coming from me. Her? In the car? Yes, Wait. I do. I think. Who is she? I think it's that famous Who is Russian this? model. What's her name? I don't know. But God, Wait, she's beautiful. Is this, is this, is this oh, the model they were talking about? Wow. You're doing that to me? Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. No. oh. Oh my gosh. It did say in the beginning, before I started this level, that you had a choice. Well, here's where we make that choice. We could either continue talking to this girl that we've already built up a conversation with, or we could just, you know, approach a, a whole new girl and then just start a whole nother fucking conversation. That is some bullshit because I don't think I want to start a whole nother conversation with a whole nother girl when I've already been talking this girl up and she feeling me. She wouldn't keep talking to me if she wasn't feeling it. I'm sorry. We're going we gonna to come to that some other time. Probably next time because if there's two choices, I got to see what it's about her. So you know what? She'll be alright. She's a model. She gets attention all the time. So you know what? She'll be alright. She don't need me. Yeah, modeling's all right, but acting's much more interesting, yeah, right? Yeah, fuck her. Yeah, I... I so much I, more varied. Yeah, mm -hmm. <laughs> she didn't even worry about me. Well, Look, she didn't... She don't care. You just have to stare. Yeah. With acting, you have to feel. We have to show something. See, Look, she has and be feelings. Um, my, I'm not saying models yeah. don't, but like, you know, yeah. it's different. I think that was the right choice. See, it was blue. Acting. Does that mean you're more interested than that. usual in Madden? Like TV she... shows and stuff? Do you watch TV? Well, I forgot. I almost forgot they ordered food. I um, I I like uh, Silicon Valley actually. That's Is that like your favorite? My favorite at the moment. It's basically like really intelligent guys that love technology. Oh, she she like all about guys? them intelligent I guys, do. huh? I do. I love intelligent guys. I think you're quite intelligent. Oh, well, oh that, we know what that now. means now. I've got my own kind of You've got business your own intelligence. Little ways, and yeah. Smarts. Well, I think you know I I can relate to the the intelligent side because I'm quite intelligent mm -hmm. so I need to end up with someone of my standard cool hey um, listen so listen. yeah I just love the way to a certain extent I don't agree with um, that and I think I'd be quite good at that as well so yeah that's a, a Silicon Valley's way what about you um I like I'm watching Handmaiden have you seen that Handmaid's Tale oh that I've one. heard of that yeah, yeah that one is messed is she up lying yeah. she ain't heard of shit it's not a comedy obviously it's like some dystopian parallel future where everything uh, goes wrong, where women, um, when the birth rate just drops near zero, huh? and they round oh, up no. all of the women that can still have babies, yeah. and what? they kind of put them with the important men to, to mate. Wow. And it's quite messed up, but it's really, really good and interesting. <laughs> it's messed Isn't up, it? but it's really, no, really no, good no, and no, interesting. You should check it out. Yeah, sounds quite interesting. I'd have to um, see if I like it. Mm -hmm. You know, it might be a little bit for me. But, um, yeah, I It'll be alright. She gon' oh, oh. feed her some cake. Tell her to look under the table for a surprise. Spoiler: It's your dick. I don't know, y'all. I'm thinking about it. I don't know, man. Spike her drink with a drug. Make her more compliant. 
Nah, I'm not doing that. That's not even funny. Like, that. that's not even funny. Talk about how it's cool to meet people like her that are not boring. Or tell her your latest video was a dating advice video for men. She wouldn't want to hear that. She gonna be like, oh, so you just you just teaching people all this shit? Like, nah, she ain't gonna like the way that comes out. Feed her some cake. I mean, we 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 starting to spice it up a little bit. Maybe 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 we'll we'll try that. Mm -hmm. This cake looks lovely. It does. Mm -hmm. Wait, come. Why don't you try just a little bit before you try yours? Uh, I'm okay. Oh, come get it. No, no, I don't really like. Maybe coconut. this was a bad okay. choice. You don't like coconut? No. Right. Okay, well, I, I think I think that was a bad choice, mm. not even realizing it. I mean, there's nothing wrong with feeding stuff. cake. I mean, listen, it's kind of romantic, right? So. Wait, that was yellow, cake? is that? No, I'm not a fruit? baby, thank you. But later, if there's some sexual tension. See, that's, that's what I was thinking. Let's be sexual. Yeah, I mean, again, I suppose this is why it's orange. Yes. I Wait, that was orange. I said it. yellow, Might but... Might work sometimes. Yeah. But risky. Mm. Hey, risky. a lot of things you do in this shit is risky, so I don't want to hear that. Ooh. Good, yeah? Hey, look, she, she had a piece of her own fucking cake. Do you have any special fine. diet restrictions you know well like sometimes it's gluten intolerant but sometimes um, only yeah. sometimes like not all the time yeah. yeah it's like sometimes if i eat too much gluten then uh, my stomach like becomes a balloon okay so i have to monitor what i eat all right um but I'm yeah i've been on that. the paleo diet before oh, that's healthy yeah because in paleo times everyone lived a long time so it's good exactly. to make sense to do that and like when you look I back know it's that. literally just vegetables and meat mm. the whole time mostly meat so i'm just constantly eating meat which constantly is eating meat. What, what kind of meat are we so, talking about maybe i'll add some to, to that meat what <laughs> i'm sorry i'm having too much fun here uh <laughs> <laughs> like I'm just <laughs> I need to calm down. I don't know what's wrong with me. Use Brad P's ten minutes of dushing questions. Brad P? You mean Brad Pitt? I, or what Brad P we talking about here? Play cards with her. Or use a question from the Marcel Prost questionnaire. I have no idea what the hell is right here. I don't like any of these answers because I two of these I don't even really know. Okay, I, I after thinking about it, I, th I think we're going to go with the questionnaire because that seduction questions, I mean, I don't think we're ready for that yet. Play cards with her, that just, that's, not that that's weird, but with her, she wouldn't like that shit. So we're going to go with the one that I, I think this will work. article, and have you heard of Marcel Proust, the author? No, no, I haven't. He wrote a book, uh, Swan's Way, or something, it's a uh, classic, and okay. he was talking about his life. I mean, she's smiling, and so... And he came up with this questionnaire where he asked a bunch of questions, and it was actually really interesting. So, for oh, example, wow. the f one of the questions was, what's your idea of perfect happiness? So, I was oh, thinking about I think it. I think she yeah, likes that. Wow, what a question. Not to put you on the spot, but I it should know. be easy, right? It's happiness. Oh, she um, likes that shit. My idea of happiness would be on my boat. Mm -hmm. On you. In the middle of the ocean. fly-ass boat. Oh, wow. Surrounding myself with Chanel handbags. Not massive waves crashing down, no? No, like, no, no, no. It's just like a peaceful, Maldives. peaceful, like, ocean. The Maldives would be fabulous. Mm -hmm. I do mm -hmm. love, I actually have a house in the Maldives. A house. Okay. Um, How many houses you got to my a house? I, I'm just out there and I have my Chanel handbags around. And because you need them on the boat. Yeah, so and, but the one, there's just one thing lacking. Like, what? I, I would like a man. Oh, yeah, should he be like tanned and? <laughs> well, I think yeah. I fit that description. Yeah, with his speedos on. With, with speedos? Oh, whoa. Well, I don't mind. <laughs> oh, he oh. can have a handbag and then give it to me. Uh, of <laughs> course. Present. Yeah. yeah. All right. Of course, she wouldn't mind that. Uh, this was a tricky one because we didn't let you know what the question would be, but obviously um, this one's pretty good and can lead to a good conversation. And in general, I would say that if you're going to be going on dates, you should ensure that you have a couple of interesting things to talk about and even having a few interesting questions like this in your back pocket is a good thing to have so that you're not at risk of running out of things to say.
No, it's like a that. great way to open up a conversation where you can maybe veer off onto something else that you both have interest in. I mean, I can make a conversation out of anything. So, Richard, man. Mm-hmm. what's your philosophy on life? Philosophy on life. I guess it's pretty simple, but it's taken me a long time to get there. But for me, it's all about finding the things I really enjoy in life. Mm-hmm. Which is what everybody should do. More of them and finding the things that I don't like. I used to be bothered all the time with phone calls, um, uh, doing annoying stuff, filling in forms and all you of gotta, that. you got to start somewhere. Mm-hmm. Like. So uh, just to arrange my life so that I'm happy with the way it is every day and just the, you know, the simple things make me happy. So it's more harmonised yeah. and balanced as well. Yeah, and an absence of bad things is, is yeah. more important than having loads of good stuff. You know, if you just get rid of all the things you don't like, yeah. then you're left with happiness, happiness right? Yeah. Ooh. Just the, How did I catch that? The simple kind of happiness that is like contentment every day, so that you don't have uh, depression or stress, that your mood is more easier like, said than done. That. Yeah, I get that. That's magical. Wait, what the, what the freak? Wait, wait, I saw that corner out of my eye. I'm like, wait, what? That just took a turn that I did not expect. Did she just literally fall? Yeah. She literally just fell. It kind of looked like, you know, she faked that. But, I mean, we're not going to say she faked it because that's mean. Take out your phone and start filming it. Gen Z. Now, that that's people nowadays. When they see a fight or anything, they will take out their phone and start filming. Whether it's good or bad. Ignore it and carry on. I hope he won't. I won't ever be that old. I want to die young, with you. Wait, that no, that that takes a bad turn. If y'all read that correctly, that is a that is a very sad one. That's a bad one. What? Help the granny, man. Help the granny. Yo, I saw the last one laugh out loud. No, we helping. Is she all right? Man? Why would I not help her? Hi. You okay? Yeah, Look, and then she's saying, "Help her, please." Like. I don't even know what happened there, but there's nothing wrong with helping her. Someone take her grand bag. Yeah. Oh God, poor old lady. Yeah. It might be the heat or something. Yeah, it's quite hot. Yeah. Hopefully she's okay. Yeah. I guess it's not a heart attack or something, is it? It's just no, it's not a heart attack. Fun, a funny turn, my granny used to call it. I've yeah. had a funny turn. It's a just funny a little turn. funny turn. Yeah. Exactly. No, I don't think it's anything. Remotely well, bad. Not. Yeah, it be okay. We need some water or something. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yes. <laughs> well done for helping the granny and not leaving her there on the floor. You're or, so kind. Yeah. Why? Why would Good we? One, yeah. Who? Who leaves her on the floor? So um, you need to send me your YouTube link so oh, yeah, I, yeah, can I can do that. DMCA you. You what? DMCA. You heard about that? No, I don't even know what that means, and I'm a YouTuber I myself. This month. Mm-hmm. Some wanker used a bit of his music. Copyright strike. Oh, I know I about that. Three, and then Not that I've had one, but I know about yeah. copyright strikes. Wow. Of course. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just don't use Pretty people's stuff up. like that. Yeah. Without their permission. If they don't like it, don't use it. Mm. What the heck okay? was that? Did you hear that? It said. Tell her your body is pretty fucked, but your dick worth. Yo, how? This is like the third time he's mentioned his dick. Yo, the third time. Usually third time's a charm, but not in this case. I'm not doing that. Say it's nothing serious, just a twinge. Say you were wearing a medical corset and the doctor said you could finally take it off tonight. It happened when I was picking a baby up that was walking out into the road. Lie. We're not going to lie. Here's the the thing. See, this is a life lesson. Like, I'm I'm being real with y'all right quick. Never lie to get a girl because here's the thing if you lie guess what happens you're not being yourself and she's gonna find out sooner or later how you really are so never lie to get a girl I don't care how cute she is if she ain't for you then you don't want her remember that so we're gonna say it's nothing serious it's no biggie it's just a bit of a twinge you know in the back I think it happened 
did some gym and then I went out feeding the squirrels and I'm like oh. bending forward and stuff and I yeah. was like, oh, you know, something just that, that can happen. Yeah, it'll be all yeah, right. And if not, I'm going to get just uh, get some stem cells and then it's all set. It's amazing. It should be all right. Yeah. But she's fine. No one likes a Mona. No, no. Guys with physical ailments. You know. oh, ones that whine about it. You don't want to be hanging around with someone who's whining. All right, but what if it really hurts? Mm -hmm. Talking about whining all the time. If that shit really hurt. The bad thing for my back was um, I was sitting for a long time because I had Chinese lessons. I was I'm learning Chinese. Really? Yeah, because yeah, it's a hard uh, language. I think it's the dark souls of languages. So I, thought, I don't learn it. I, I learned French, hard. but that shit, Could I don't you remember say it. Say something? Uh, I will say something in Chinese. <laughs> Look, I don't know. She don't know what that shit mean, but she like it. Oh. Yeah. Girls like it when it's guys have accents or saying? can speak another language. Uh, a bunch of different stuff. I said, have you eaten? I said, oh. uh, something about how you look. And, uh, something about how you look. Chinese, but not He's not going to well, say what it is. Yeah. He said, you got a big He's ass. I don't know what he said. Um, commit a criminal act together to bond with her. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa now. Hypnotize her with your teacup. This ain't get out. What are we talking about? Hypnotize her. Find a superficial commonality. If I'm reading that right, that's not bad. That's not bad, right? <laughs> uh, I, or if you could wake up anywhere in the world, where would it be? We've already been talking about stuff like that, so I think that's the safest one we can go with. That other one, I don't really know. For you. Okay. Uh, if you could wake up anywhere in the world tomorrow, where would it be? Whole world. I'd say Rome. Mm -hmm. Rome. She's thinking I've of that never Colosseum. Been there, actually, considering but, I travel the world <laughs> all the time. But we'll travel to um, New Jersey. Come, come lay up with me. Mm -hmm. Come Good see me. He's called Chucky. All right. So you want Chucky. to show Chucky the sights and stuff? Yeah? You got well, Chucky. What, what would he like most? Do you think? Yo. Colosseum. Yeah. Mm. Colosseum course, more I, than I, like I said a that too. sausage shop or something. Yeah. Well, I'd take him to the ice cream shop. Apparently, ah, there's a ice delicious cream. ice cream shop there, so I'd take him there. Yeah, have a bit, have a bit, yeah. Yeah, mm. just share a little ice cream together. He'll be in my handbag, of course. That's sweet. Well, you'd have to send me the pictures. I'd like to see Chucky yeah. and Rome, the album. Mm-hmm. Well, you have to send me the pictures, but I need your number first. This is a solid question. Uh, it's one of the kind of example questions that make for good conversation from my first book. I and forgot he had books like of this that, shit. But yeah, again, like it's uh, travel and it's quite precise. It gets someone to fantasize a little bit about a pleasant subject. So I think it's Yo, a I'm, solid I'm, choice. And I'm you should also have book. your answer ready I, I mean, in case not, she asks not, you back. Not for me. I mean, from, from, from my friend. Cal. And now we could just sit here and just stare at each other. Oh, wait, never mind. Not staring at each other. I, wait. Do I know? You like big surprises? Wow. Um, check it out. Get yeah. out! Wait, that's her? I know. Oh no. Oh no. Look, look, look at her face. Why did we ever look over there? I knew I recognized her. And from the thing that just showed us, that had to be one of the bad choices. Because I remember even doing, like when we finished the whole, the finished the game, I went back and did all the bad choices for the first game. And obviously, that had to be one of them. It's been a while, so. Wow. I guess he actually showed her his his thing. Okay. We got we got options here. We can either hide from her. Well, after that, I mean, maybe that's your best option. Probably proclaim that you slept with her, which ain't even true because even when we got the number, we never even really did anything with her. We just got the number, or give her a little wave. I mean. From my experience, when I first did this, we ended off things right. So them bad choices technically don't even really matter. We're going to give her a little wave. I mean, we used to know her. So, I mean. Hey, Anastasia. See? Hey. We used to know her. And she was How on the phone. You, you look so nice. Oh, boy. Great dress. Oh, boy. Her face did not look like she was How's happy to called? see me. Look at that. Oh, boy. What is she How's about to. Um. What what the hell is she telling? Are you still dating that guy? What the hell did she just um, tell? Bye, nice to see you. Yeah, come on, bitch. Like, say what, something. What'd she say? She said that you got a small dick <gasps> and um, <laughs> you can't sing. <laughs> oh. Not 
Oh. Move. Um, not going to end well. Not going to end it well. It didn't. There. It didn't, as you can see. But uh, we already taken it this far, so um, she literally said, "I got a small dick and I can't sing." I don't care about the can't sing part because you know what? It's not about the can't sing. Now the other thing, yeah, I got a problem with that. Tell her that you're you'll sing, and if your singing is good, then it must mean it's huge. Tell her you have a really small one and joke about it. Tell her in the fact that you don't have one. That's defensive. Because then she's going to think that you're being defensive. And then she's going to think that you really do. Or say it's your jealous ex and she always does that. Now I'm thinking about something here. We could either do B or C. B, it depends on how he jokes about it. Because the thing with him is we can read these answers. But then he can say it differently. I know with the C, that's that that's probably the safest one, but this probably could work too if he set, does it right. He does it right, and I don't know if he's gonna do it right. You know, we, we just gotta go the safest route here. I don't listen to her. You know, we were dating for a while, and she just was a bit of a but nut job. They didn't so, date at all, though. Um, yeah, I thought she was gonna be nice, but she's just trying to cause me problems. What we she dated did. and everything was good. Sometimes but, that can happen, though. Yeah. It's, um, Sometimes girls can get wild. Oh, you know, she's a girl, after. so she did knows. You, did you end it with her? Yeah, she wanted, well, she, yes, but for the right reasons. So she was, you know, good girl, all of that stuff. But then she became super serious, super jealous, controlling, calling me all the time. Where are you? What are you doing? And she was a bit of a bunny boiler. Okay, didn't give you your space. <laughs> no, bunny boiler. even worse yeah. than that. Yeah, it was like fatal attraction. So it was a bit, yeah, but okay. it seems like she's still on it because it was, Quite a while ago. Look, wow. yeah. Maybe you should get a restraining order on her or something. No, nah, I'm gonna get a so, baseball yeah. bat. Anyway, the main <laughs> thing is don't listen to it and just yeah. Yeah, I'll try. It. Maybe on date, another date, you could try. Yeah, sure. Oh, she's already planning. She already think about the other date. In this case, you know, it's really hard to come up with a winning answer, and that's probably the best of a bad bunch to dig yourself out of the hole. Yeah, because we yeah, already put her a hole by bringing really over anything here. Else. Otherwise, you don't want to look like you're putting her, another woman down, but. Mm -hmm. You're just trying to be honest about the situation. So, I mean, yeah, that was. Are the you best. single? Oh, yeah, I am actually. Look at her twirling I'm her hair. Single. Wow, and definitely. You? Yeah. Of I'm course single. you are. She's feeling um, me. Do you fancy meeting again? Yes. <laughs> you didn't even have to ask. What you talking about? Tell her that she better meet you again, or you will kill. <sighs> this guy. This guy, so just feeding squirrels together or just meet, maybe meet for a drink. Say your porn. <laughs> mm. Very, very bad. Or you're in a gender fluid and can meet any time. What? That's a weird way to say that you could just meet any time, but so just feeding squirrels together. From what I've seen about these girls, they like feeding squirrels, so we're going to say that. So let's definitely meet again soon. Mm hmm. We could, what could we do together? We could go feed squirrels together? Yeah. I'd love to feed like the squirrels. squirrels. See, look, yeah, she likes this not? shit too. Or just go for a drink. Yeah, one or the other. Next thing, great. Nice one, the classic squirrel feeding session. It always works, always right? winner with, uh, yeah, the ladies. Maybe not, but of course, you know, I find this on every my day. town, but every night, near y'all, yeah. Night. Excellent, yeah. Yeah, see? I just get the check, actually. Thanks. So what's your plans for the coming week? You busy? Um, well, I have a spa treatment. Hey, um, yeah. Just one? Of course you do. Yeah, well, tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> no, girls always have, have spa like treatment. Week. Um, I've got to get my nails redone. Uh, I've got a shopping trip, actually, with my mother. Well, that's all so, nice stuff. Nothing, yeah. uh, oh, nothing too bad. Oh, I've got Pilates class as well. Excellent. Pilates. So nothing strenuous. You've got to keep that body great. Right. Well, the Pilates can be quite strenuous. That's actually. true, actually, yeah. Could be. All right. All right, the first one I see is you pay because you're a gentleman. You, you guys too. Oh, should I? She, I came to her table. Oh, no, no, no. I got to pay. No, stop that. Let, I'll get this. My treat. Thank you. I came to nice your table. Yeah, I have to drugs. do that. She didn't invite me. Bad. It's always good to tip. Yeah, I always do. Then next time they remember you. They do. And we will be coming back In here soon, opinion, is what he's trying to say. should always pay if it's his invitation. I agree, and I agree on the other hand as well, actually. If a woman has specifically invited something, you know, it's nice to 
I think it's nice either or. You know, if you if you invited see, someone, this is a girl to an event, with sense. You know, I don't. I think it's your place. Definitely, because yeah. you can't say come out to this fancy restaurant with right. me. Right. By the way, you're paying. No, but I don't mind Dutch either. <laughs> Which is splitting it. That's Dutch. It. I mean, we've never. I've never heard that term, but yeah, splitting it. See, that's a girl with sense. Because she said it's never wrong with the girl paying if she invited. If the guy did it, yeah. So actually, that, that makes sense. See, y'all girls nowadays just always think the man should pay for everything. Yeah, that's a little, that's bad. That's bad. Take her number, arrange meet her again, or ask if she has other <laughs> for different days of the week. This dude is crazy. So I, we should I, definitely I, meet again soon. Why don't I give you my phone and just unlock it? And you can just put your number in there and I'll be in touch. Look at her face. Does she want to do it? Great. That's the right option. Uh, setting up the second date. All good. Well, let's see if she actually does it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, okay. Great. Okay. Ooh. Just I was kind of scared. to make sure I do it right. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I was scared. I thought she was going to say no. Oh. Hopefully she didn't give me a fake number. <laughs> I don't like that. Great, nice one. You got the best possible ending Ooh, on this we branch. Got it like that. The first level. Great, congratulations. You've got the best possible outcome. Because I am that guy. I am him. I tell y'all that. Now, I got a bit of a dilemma here. Because this is still, that supermodel is still technically chapter one. So. I'm thinking, should we just make this a long ass episode? Because we've never done that before. Hmm. I'm thinking we make this a long episode. Because, yeah. We gotta make this special for Super Seducer 2. You know what? Yeah. Y'all don't see me very often, so you know what? I got to make it right for y'all. Since before we even get to the model. Let's just see what happens when we call Mahmoud. I'm calling Mahmoud like that. But let's just see. I, I, I just Lonzi, want to I see. I to do this, but I've got something really urgent. So it's lovely to L meet look you and all that. But <laughs> I'm, I'm glad I didn't pick right. that. Um, bye. Gosh, Yo. Yeah, I'm so glad I didn't <sighs> go that route. That is rude the way he did it. I didn't know he was going to do it like that. What he got? This better be important too. Hey buddy, what's so urgent? It is a YouTube convention, my friend. What? And now is your chance. Ooh. That's Who's not important, bro. The vice journalists. Great. Betty Jack. Awesome. Perfect. Boogie. Yeah, this ah. is. This, I, I'm like glad I didn't call his ass the first time. Fucking prick. Alpha rad. Friend without benefits. Like without? Guys too. That's never a good thing. It's also the mini mint. Nah, he didn't answer my email, so whatever. Anyone else? Bro, Jared. Let's fucking do this. I don't know. How many of these people he's Lisa, naming? Bring me my special briefcase. Special? What is he about to do? That's Lisa. Okay, she got it going on a little bit. Can we get? I mean, I guess we already have got her. It's good, Lisa. What we got in there? <laughs> Do you see his face? Die, you fuckers. <laughs> no, he really didn't. Game over, you won. <gasps> what? What was... Y'all was having too much fun, weren't y'all? Because what the hell is that? All right, now this is where we get to see about that motto. We already had you, so you know what? <laughs> We're going to leave you in the back burners. Look, <laughs> he can't even keep it together. No, I hope you don't mind. I'm just going to get her autograph quickly. Oh, I'll, okay. I'll be back probably. She Hang said on. probably. <laughs> yeah. Right. She was actually was starting fun. to like him too. That's crazy. Wait, she pulled up. I know he did this. Yo, he really. He's really. Let me let y'all know something right now. 
you never do this. You never chase a girl because you're not gonna get no. anywhere like that. Oh. How far was he had to, did he have to run oh. to do this? Oh. This is crazy, yo. Cause this girl ain't that cute to be running after however long he did that. <laughs> the, my mouse is on the start humping. <laughs> I can't. I can't. Oh my gosh. She gonna run me over if I do that. Tell her your auntie is in the hospital. You need to get there ASAP. That's a lie. You don't want that. Ask for a lift to some far off place. That's weird. Pretend to be a cop. Tell her she's cute and... <laughs> be direct and say that she looks at me. You didn't want to lose the chance to meet her. With her, from running all that fucking time... We got to be direct at that point. <laughs> you got to take a I breath. I in that place. Mm-hmm. And I just think you she look amazing. She got a nice-ass car, to too. Come and talk to you. Thank you. I didn't know I'd need to run five kilometers, but... She was trying to avoid anyway, you. Didn't want to miss the opportunity. That's crazy. He really ran to do that shit. Cool. That's the right option. Obviously... If you go to any great difficulty to talk to a woman, it's then strange to be really indirect. So, right. You know, if you had to cross the road or run through a crowd or run for, I don't know, 20 miles to speak 20 to 20 miles. That was not about 20 miles. It when you get there. Mm -hmm. Anyway. He's still pink. My name's Richard. My name is Marina. I was about nice to say, is she going nice to say? Nice to meet you, sir. How are you doing today? Fine, and you? Tired, but, um, now, why? Why? I think I've run five miles or kilometers yeah. or something. Really? Not run yeah. five miles. Good he cardio. just said Good he cardio. had to run. It's a long way. Yeah, but it's nice. It's a nice place here for running. Uh, Does yeah. she not understand that we were running for her? I don't think she gets that. He just said that. Tell her about how she needs to work, walk rather than drive. Yeah, you don't need shit. Validate her and. That she is open and friendly. Say you recognize her from somewhere in a jokey way. No, because we just... We, no, we don't recognize her. We, we're not going to go You know what? There. I've been chasing you for ages, but um, you look really open and friendly. He keeps friendly, saying so. for ages, like it was that long. I think it might be all right. Is it right? You're a friendly person? Yeah, I believe so. Mm. Of course she would say that. Okay. She wants to pull off this so bad. This is cool because by saying that she's open and friendly... Then, in the minutes following this, she's likely to be more open and friendly because she's already agreed that she is. And you're also complimenting her on her character and not necessarily how she looks, and this is always a very good option. Man, I love that they have the girls' perspective. Marina, I've got an in intuition this. about you immediately. <laughs> you Tell me. Um, I think that you're very tough and independent. How can you get that and so already? It's hard for people to get to know you. Is that right? Yes. Yeah. But the, with people that you're close to, you're good friends, family, you're actually very warm and open and kind. She likes to hear that. Yep. You're that right. right. Yes. Good of intention. course you're going to agree with that. Why would she say no to that? <laughs> That's a... I, I, ask what's more numerous, the men she slept with or the book she's read. Ask her if she likes it in her. <laughs> Yo, can y'all like chill with these answers? I can't even. Th I, I I can't even bear to see what happens if I was to choose B. I I. I said I was gonna choose more bad ones, and I only chose one so far. But it's like these ones. I can't even. I can't even like. It's so bad to where I I can't even watch myself if I push it. And and models already get a bad reputation for thinking that they sleep with a lot of people. I I don't know. I got to go to safe route here. I'm sorry. I can't do it. Yeah. Maybe t maybe so the next time we'll choose more bad answers. But now I've got to ask. Are you boring or spontaneous? I'm spontaneous. Of course. Yeah. I believe there are people who will say, I'm boring, yes. What's wrong with being boring? <laughs> no, but well, you were very, boring. like... 
immediate, that you're spontaneous. What's something very spontaneous that you've done? Yeah, put on a well, fucking spot. Well, actually, I stopped here in the middle of the road. Talk to for, me. To, to a guy running after my car. <laughs> that was okay. spontaneous. I guess it was, yeah. <laughs> she, she got it. She got that one. She got that. This is the best possible option. And, you know, in this situation, it is a very spontaneous situation. You know, you've run off to the car, talking to her, and you want to suggest... Uh, going somewhere right there and then, so her being spontaneous would be good. And most people would agree that they're spontaneous rather than being boring. Even if they're boring. I don't boring. think anyone would admit, ad admit to being boring. Being Why would they? Or boring? Um, I can be spontaneous, I think would be my answer to that one. Excellent. I mean, yeah, there's nothing wrong with saying that either. What have you been up to today? Um, actually, I was in the gym. I just finished my training. A gym? Um, Don't you have a dress on, like always, the way I'm seeing? So you're a supermodel, so you need to look like this in the gym, or you did it afterwards? You mean my makeup? Yeah, all the makeup, the sexy What's dress. Yeah. <laughs> the makeup's great. Exactly, the sexy dress, too. No out, way you went to the gym. I was born like this. No, I'm <laughs> kidding. I just have some other plans after my training. Ah, so after so that, you're you going just put a dress super on? Super glamorous now. Super glamorous. <laughs> I'm going to have my cold pressed juice now. Cold pressed juice. Can I come with you? That'll be some good juice for you to try. <laughs> Don't use that. Don't use that. Which juice bar? I'll take an Uber and meet you there. Maybe let's just sit in the car because girl drivers are what? That's sexist right there. Say something about cold pressed. <laughs> God, what to? <laughs> Yo. I can't even. I still can't even. I got 20 minutes. I'll pay for the juice. You pay for the gasoline. That's the. That's the most. Yeah, I love that's cold the best fresh option. juice. It's better than just the normal fresh juice, and that's better than the packet juice, right? I want some juice right nice. now. Actually, well, I tell you what. Um, I'll buy the juices if you pay for the gasoline. What do you say? I'll come with you. <laughs> great idea. She's saying great idea, but she don't really know me like that. So. So this is an interesting one, and. Whenever you try to suggest something, some kind of, uh, you know, date or going somewhere, if you suggest it like this, you know, I'll pay for the juice, you pay for the gasoline, uh, it's much easier to say yes. If you say, can I come with you to the juice bar, um, it's a little bit weaker and she's often going to say no, that is, even if she might yo, otherwise that agree. That is smart as shit, yo. Yeah, and you're also elongating the I'm dates telling you. by suggesting there's longevity and paying for the gasoline you're going to go further <laughs> on in the look day. even she's nice she's impressed with that yeah all right shall we go okay get in yep don't mind if i do don't mind if i do girl oh, this is nice sitting right next yeah. to you cool so which juice bar were you going to um i was going to the new one in the center you know it's, i don't remember the name she, didn't, um, she don't know i'm not sure but you know what there's a place um it's not too far, I think, but it's in a beautiful location. You might even say romantic. It's by the lake. <laughs> this, you went to that one. This man no, talking about his house. Don't even try to act like he's not talking about his house. Do you know the address? Because I don't know how to go there. Mm, no, but if I put it in, juice, juice bar. Maybe. No, he's he's lake trying to take juice. her to his house. Yeah, he's, trying to be, <laughs> he's trying See? to be slick. Okay. So you just go there and then there oh, and then there. Really? So not far away? Yeah, oh, wait. Far. He actually is trying to go to a juice bar. I thought he was really trying to be funny. Look at his face. <laughs> you want to build trust because, uh, yeah, she don't know you. Tell her you want to get her to know her intimately. You don't tell her that. After training, there's nothing better than a massage. Did you know that 93% of girls mess? <laughs> Text a female friend to call. Now, I think that's probably the best answer. But again, a female friend, like... That could go wrong in a way, in a way, but we're gonna we're gonna see. If oh, sorry, my friend. I think that's. Hey, how you doing? Oh, hi, Richard. Yeah, I'm just with uh, my friend Marina in a car. What? Yeah, just driving for juice. Um, hang on. I know he is not. Yeah. Talk to me. Yeah. Hi. Richard, the great guy. You got that's a that is not a right. girl. I can't wait to meet you. <laughs> okay. Okay, bye. Yo. Thanks, bye. <laughs> How many times is he going to get me to it. do that? Sorry I knew that was not a girl. No, Good friend it. of mine. It's okay. Maybe you'll meet sometime. Yo, we'll that's see. crazy. Alright, let's go. So it's straight here. Okay, let's see. 
Yeah, go straight, girl. And then turn right. This is a bit ridiculous, but the concept is definitely a sound one, which is that uh, when a woman meets a strange man, there's certain right. things that will make her feel more safe and comfortable. Uh, one of which would be, for example, if uh, she could see you know, his friends or family. But he faked that, friends, though. And things that basically show that he's not a serial killer. Yes, I'd say that's always a good shout. And also it gives her an instant, she's instantly comfortable with the other female, or it's more likely to be that that would be the case. I'll give you some good at Hey. Already that? Okay. Mm. Um. So <laughs> where is it? <laughs> yeah. I think it was here. Really? Oh, really? Shut down. Now they've they got this Coca Cola place over there. Maybe. This dude. Or oh, maybe you, know. you planned this. Oh. <laughs> you know he planned it with his face looking like that. Tell her no and that you are very honest. Of course you don't want to say that you actually did this on purpose. Say that lots of girls have fantasy of sex in public places or apologize profusely. No, we're honest around here. We ain't do this shit on purpose. So how come it's not here anymore? Marina, look, I'll tell you something about me. Right. I'm very honest. Right. So if I intended to bring you to a place with no juice bar, and I knew that there was no juice bar there, I would tell you. But honestly, I really thought it was here. I haven't been here for a while, and I guess it shut down. But we could just take a minute and no, we could just take a minute. Beautiful place. Look at yeah. her face. Yep. And maybe go for juice somewhere else. Mm. Well, actually, it's a really good place. Yeah. Glad you like it. Yeah, you can you can take the scenery out. In this just... moment, uh, only honesty will work, and I think it would be unattractive to be overly overly apologetic. Uh, but being honest, obviously, is good. I think honesty is always the best policy. Of course, it is. That's how we get places in life. You know, I used to come here when I was young, mm -hmm. um, feed the ducks, the swans. And so... now, when you are not young anymore, I know I'm too like busy. That. So, what are you going to do? What are we going to do? Hmm. Nah, I guess we that's what we have to find out together. Start trying to grow part <laughs> That's f Ooh. Nope. Let's say F the juice bar and come to my house. For the for the answers we have, that's the best choice. I I'm I've already been doing this for too long. I've got a radical idea. Radical. Tell yeah. me. Yep. Radical. So get this. Juice bar's not here. Yep. Obviously. So, we could go to the Coca-Cola place, but no, we don't really want that. She we don't. could go and try and find another juice bar, but... Mm. Hmm? <laughs> She's like, what, what are you I've trying to say? a juice machine. I've got oranges, pineapples, maybe I've even got some mangoes. So why don't we go to my place? Go to my place. I'll make us some delicious juice. Oh, yeah. So your place? Mm hmm For the juice? Yes. Just the juice. Mm. <laughs> she... Well, okay. Mm. She didn't seem so... Excellent. She didn't seem so good with it first. Nice one. This is the right option. Obviously, it's very bold. Oh. Uh, but you've already got some indicators of interest. She does want juice. You got the juice. Why not? Exactly. Look, there's nothing wrong with being bold and confident. combine the two That's together. You know, to, to stop. It's an attractive quality. Good luck. <laughs> now, if it don't work, what can you say about you that? Know, one of the things I like most in life is how you can make small decisions and it just changes your life in a completely unexpected, exciting way. Yeah, like today, how we met. Yeah, I don't know where you're leading to, but I need to tell you. What? If I'm coming to a house, All right. I'm just coming to have juice. Juice. Not sex. Not sex. Juice. Tasty juice. When did he anyway, say? Anyway, you should remember that I just come out of my kickboxing class. Oh, okay. she's mm -hmm. you trying to threaten me? First of all, <laughs> wait, wait. She said not sex. Who even said anything like that? That must mean you was thinking about it. Cause I didn't say shit like that. Wow. Okay. 
if a girl brings up sex, that means she was thinking about it. Because there's no way that you would know that he was thinking about sex. Just because he says, go to my place, some people ain't that bold to be like, oh, I'm going to I'm gonna get you like that now. No, I'm using you for your juice recipes. Nothing more than that. Don't be so presumptuous. Say you respect whatever decision she makes. I'm not that foodie. It's harder to get me into <laughs> Tell her she doesn't have... To, oh, whoa. Well, nope. I like the first one. I like the first one. You know what? You got me all wrong. You've been had me wrong. If that's what you thought. I just knew that you would have amazing juice recipes. I think you know your stuff when it comes to juice. Right. So I wasn't thinking sex at all. Not at all, no, girl. Nothing like that. No, nothing. No flirting. No kissing. No holding Look, hands. Look, he's putting it out there because he's like, uh, we could probably be doing all this Definitely later. Definitely not sex. Mm. Just juice. Very, very tasty juice. Yo. Okay, do you? Okay. I need to shake? No, 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 no I can not shake. Okay, no touching. I respect yeah, you. Yeah, that's what I, a bit too much. Maybe <laughs> later, when you know me better. Yo, he... This dude's smooth as hell. I know what he's trying nice to one. do. Uh, that's the correct choice. Again, it's quite playful, exactly. but it's a little bit tongue-in-cheek. So she does get the idea that there's still this undercurrent of sexual tension. Yeah, she should know this is just a little joke and it's quite funny. Oh, it's funny. <laughs> you very thirsty? Mm -hmm. I'm super thirsty. Look, that juice is not going to cold press itself. Let's get out of here. Let's go to get okay, that damn go. juice. She knows what's about to happen as soon as we get there. 21 minutes later. Look, she's making herself comfortable on your couch hey, let's get this juice going on girl okay. this is orange and pineapple wow, that's nice. taste that yeah, taste that shit. had it for the first time in uh, Singapore I'm Singapore oh, cool well, tell me what you think mm, really nice it's of refreshing. course it's really nice it's good right yeah when it's hot outside it's perfect I believe what's your favorite juice Actually, my favorite is tomato juice. Ew. Yeah. Like nice. tomato, Bloody tomato, Mary, yeah, potato, potato. After I hate yeah, that. When you have something good, it's perfect tomato juice. Oh, very nice. Ew. Who cool. enjoys tomato I, juice? You know what's very good? In tropical countries, and they have all the different fruits. You can have dragon fruit, uh, sour salt. Like all sour salt. Sounds so nice, tropical countries. Yeah. What the like hell is sour salt? I'm, I, I was just thinking about that for a second. Use Adam Leon's bad sex routine. <laughs> Ask her about her sex life. Find out about her passions or this criteria routine, which I don't even know any about. Find out about what she likes to do. That's Marina, what's something you're really passionate about in life? Mm, you want to know? Yeah, that's why I asked, to girl. Tell the truth, uh, photography is my passion. Mm -hmm. It's not just my job. It's just where my heart belongs i like so it I see story, you find out about somebody's passions body, you know you got them in the right and place and I love you know it's genuine watching me and i let people see me in magazines and everywhere. see you i love this to so, like see all of you i believe that i can uh, show them the person that i am mm -hmm. and always to tell some story um, and it's always different, right? Because you have different looks. You know what I just emotions. realized? Yeah, um, they had one sip of that juice and... Yeah, he put it over there. Like, yeah, they're not touching that again. I already know it. Wow. But you Ooh. never forget who you are for real. Well, yes, well, of course. I always remember her and I. Better. But my favorite role is actually the role of devil. Ooh. The role of devil? Oh, she's one of them. A lot of the time, it's very good to just get someone to talk about something that they enjoy. So that might not be their job, it might, might not be uh, food, it might not be travel, but every person has something that they're passionate about and that they love to talk about. And when you're talking about something that you're passionate about, you're often your most attractive, I find. Don't you think? Definitely, yeah. Expressive and smiling and energetic. Yeah. I'm liking this, this. I'm liking this. Was it Thai boxing? Or? No, it was kickboxing. Kickboxing. Uh, kickboxing. You know what is it? Of course we know yeah. what kickboxing uh, is. That's What's the, the difference between kickboxing and Thai box? Ah, you're testing me. Okay, so uh, Thai boxing is where you can kick, punch, but you can also elbow. Right. So it's awful. And oh, he's showing her his knowledge. You want to see real kickboxing in your life? Oh, huh? Mm -hmm. 
yeah. do I want to see it? Yes, sir. Yeah, you I've want to try? It. With you? Yes. In this dress? Yes, in this dress. In these heels? In She's this trying dress. to. Sounds great. Yo. Yeah, show me something. Like She's that. trying to test me, yo. You ready? I was born ready. Maybe Let's now. Start. What if she I'm actually tried? Let's start. Okay. Now what I'm thinking is, hold on. Before I even look at these choices, she's testing me. Oh, oh you don't want to do that, home girl. Because what if she actually tries to like? Because I I've seen too many movies of where yeah, you want to try and then she'll actually like actually hurt me for real. Like she she looked like she's playing around talking about it, but you never know. You never know. Have a little spar and then judo throw her into the couch or knock. Her I knock her out to show your masculinity. Keep calling her. Oh no, that's that's what's gonna really make her knock you out. Do soul gazing to connect her. You know what? She already made this challenge, so let's complete it. <laughs> let's complete so, it. Let's learn some things. Ah, let's what? just try. What the? What the? What the? Ready, ready? Yeah. What the? Oh, she's not even ready. <laughs> Got you. What the? What the? Not the perfect kickboxing. That's not perfect. All right, let's try something else. You ready? Watch this one. Three steps. One, two, and then. <laughs> Yo, that was smooth as shit. Uh, I'm not call the right you. option in this case, but obviously do not try this at home. I'm uh, highly trained in the arts martial. So am so I, actually. I can, I can do, do that too. But the point to mention is that, you know, to bridge that gap between the non physical to the physical, you've got dancing, you've got massage, you've got just, you know, getting closer. A little play fight. I, I can't believe tingling, he really did that. Stuff, that was smooth as shit. I would say watch where you're throwing her potentially if you're going to be making Well, that's why you have a couch or a bed. But not on a spiked bed or. Yeah, yeah. Maybe mm. not. Can you fight? Do you do any? Yeah, I can do judo actually. Hmm, amazing. Watch out. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was. That was smooth. I ain't even gonna lie. That was smooth as hell. This is mad. We're only just mad. You know, that's true. But I don't know about you, but to me, everything just feels really right. That is the corniest shit I've heard. It works sometimes, but sometimes it's, it's just, you can hear it. Get her to sign a contract. Try to beat your sex beat run record. Or say that this is so cool that you're both sober and she's spontaneous and not boring. Obviously you know the only cool? answer you could give. It's the daytime, we're not drunk. So we have this real connection. A real connection, that's yeah. what y'all need to see in girls, a real connection, not just their looks. So this is one of those situations where she could see it as either weird and something that shouldn't happen. Right. Or if you paint it as something cool and spontaneous and interesting and different and happening for the right reasons, then she's more likely to see it that way too. But if you kind of let the doubt go too long, then, then she's she going to be like, yeah, weird, we need to stop. Right. Yeah, you need to be confident with your actions for sure. Always got to be confident when you get to that level. Wait, why is there subtitles happening when, oh, 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 oh yeah. It's a little too far, my boy. Yeah. Choose for Marie. Why would they give me this option? Why would you give her the chance to, choice to leave? Like, not to be weird about it, but like, they've already been good with it. So, I don't want to leave. Maybe, maybe I go. I'll go back in and see what happens if you leave. But, like, to show y'all. But I'm not gonna choose for her to leave because she was with it. She was with it. I'm glad we get to choose for her though because that's a that's I like that woman's perspective. Nice one. Obviously the perfect choice, best choice in the game. Well of done, thank you. <laughs> of course it is. Great, yes, well it's absolutely a woman's prerogative. Whatever you choose, as long as it's your decision and you're happy with it, that's great. She makes it so much better. She makes it so much better because she's a this woman. This is a nice way to start. So it's not a sexist thing where a man is telling you everything. You to... All right, I have to see. Like I said, I have to see because I, I hope this is not too bad to where she's like hitting him and stuff. I, I have to see. No, 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 no. That's wrong. You sure? 
Yeah. Like. Sure. Okay. Ready? No sex today, yeah? <laughs> no. Okay. Well, right. No sex, no sex. Don't make it seem like you're so, yeah, don't make it seem like you're so, like, upset about that. Dude, why'd you choose that? Help me out, man. <laughs> Yo, this dude's stupid. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that, to be honest. Um, Very wrong. No, there's nothing wrong with that. But you know, that's why it's a good no choice right too. There's no right or wrong answer. It's completely True. the woman's prerogative. True. He's only saying that because of because <laughs> of how this game is supposed to go. This Yo, is a nice way. You to know, stop. he doesn't mean that in a bad way. When he said, "Help me out," yeah, obviously, it's it's a woman's choice. Come on now. Woo! This was a long one, everybody. But again, I had to give y'all this. Cause like I said, it's been a while. Plus, you know, we looking good, and this this obviously is a better one than the first. Not to not to rag on the first one. The first one is also good, and I just found out that there's a third one too. So we gotta get through this one quick. I mean, not so quick, but quick enough to where y'all don't forget about this. And then there's a third one. The next one is boss and secretary. Ooh. That's a trick. That's a tricky one. See, that's work relationships. They don't. Not that they don't work, but it's, that's a tricky one because what if y'all break up? It's gonna be awkward as hell, and you're not gonna want to be around that person. <laughs> oh, trust me. I, I'm talking like I'm speaking from experience because I kind of am, but we're not gonna. We're not gonna go into that. But let me just calm myself down because we're not gonna get into that. <sighs> we gotta think about good vibes. I'm the one with good vibes, so. We're not going to get that that serious. I hope y'all enjoyed that because that was a long one, like I said. Y'all better be ready for this next time. Stay thirsty, my friends. Let's go! <laughs>